work that's over and out right so this is main mission that makes sense to, to go with tick plugging itself into uh, electrical cabinet near the radio mask at Sultan was the reason for the disruption of the radio communications removing the tick restored radio communications only for a short period of time during which a Soviet soldier named Sergei Kutsnov uh, could be briefly heard. According to Pontus's shaky command of Russian, however, he was unable to hear what their objective was. Pontus and Therese assumed that one of the other military radio masts took over the jamming right away. Finding the next uh, location of the nearest radio mast, restoring the signal is critical to re-establishing contact with the Soviet uh, soldier. So that is the mission because we, we desperately need to find out what the heck is going on where are these robots from where are the people gone to thinking about it shotguns probably not the best weapon to cover yourself as you're going out of there So we'll get a bike. There's our bike. Right, so we've got a bike. Let's get on it. This is one of the few times where we actually see what your character looks like. Ah, I need to do some a little bit of work before I can go out. That was pretty easy, wasn't it? Got a nice ramp now, though. That I can use to get out over the gate which is underneath so let's just quickly look at the map over and out we've just been there but that's the first would be the first part of the mission is to try and get the information really of where the but it should be relatively free of robots yes they do move around and yes there are random uh random patrols but we've thinned out the robots at the base And the bikes are actually a fairly good way of getting around. Just trying to avoid running over the body. Hello, the silly guy. Uh, that's a, a that's a, a, a definitely a, rem a memorable name that you've got yourself a memorable tag in game oh, sorry in uh, Twitch the silly guy uh, uh, any particular reason why you chose that particular name right so there's weapons to be found in Saltine Bunker still it's interesting thought we'd done a reasonable job going through there right indication seems to be there might be some information in here it's nice of them to sometimes hold you by the hand map Yeah, 
interesting conversation there between the two. Uh, um, the civilian Therese. The silly guys, yeah, just random name generator. Ah, well, okay, fine. The silly guy. One of the. The silly guy, thank you for the follow. Very helpful. You find you've got yourself some. Um, some emotes for being a follower. Uh, help yourself uh, to to using them. Please do use them in the stream and and wherever you go. Please use them. Uh, some of them. Well, I don't claim I own any of them. Uh, they're all got in from elsewhere. But yeah, help use them. Uh, they're supposed to be fun. And um, let's y yeah, feel free. Thank you for the follow. It was very useful, very very helpful to me that uh, you guys f do follow. So the civilian Therese is saying, um, uh, "Let's contact the, uh, the the Soviets." But the military guy um, is saying that, uh, uh, "Hang on." Don't rush. The Soviets could still be behind this, even if it looks as though something of us, some of it was organised by parts of the S Swedish military. It's it, it seems to be very, very strange what's going on here. Right. So we've got a, a map with a marker that seems to indicate that the um, the nearest radio mask is. It seems to be a very funny map as well, but never mind. Yeah, what do you think to the the latest in technology in uh, 1989? Um, and the TV screens? Pretty good, aren't they? Um, anything up top? No. Or newspaper, anything on the newspaper. A picture of a lighthouse by the looks of it. So there's the bike. Oh, it fell over. Is there anything in here while well, we're in the area? Bit of ammunition, nothing major. Don't want to spend a lot of time going through, but a quick look. Okay. That guy had stuff on him. An adrenaline shot, that could be useful. Anything in the truck. Empty truck. Okay. Out we go, trying to get to. So yeah, we need to come back and loot the bunker properly some point. But I'm trying to find out what's happening. Didn't quite get the wheelie. You're just starting your playthrough on a piece. Uh, so that's Generation Zero. Yeah, it is a fantastic. And and the world really does. Have you had it long, the game? Yeah, the, the, the much of the story is in, in what you see visually as much as what you hear can I admit I was expecting to find a hunter and some doggos there Uh, hang on a sec, what have we got up here? This could be painful. <coughs> the 
could be very painful if I can't get out of the ditch. Please let me out of the ditch. Great. That shows you just how close you can get to the robots when you're on a bike. Um, yeah, steam sail. You've plat platinumed it on the... Right, okay. It's a fantastic game, really is. Uh, it's so different from what it was when it released, but... Uh, um, and I love this. I I do love the storytelling, even though some people say there is no story. Hang on, what's that in the boot? Oh, nothing major. I thought that was something interesting. I see movement up ahead. Ooh, it's a hunter. Switch round the weapons. Right. The hunter with the weapon I've got if I'm lucky I can get a quick kill. If I'm lucky. Uh but the chances are I'm not high for a quick kill. Yes, it's got its ex fuel tank exposed. 600 hours, yeah. You bought it on release, right. So you'll know that uh, well when was the last time you played then? I can see something in the back of this car. It looks like a gas canister, which would explode the car and the uh, the hunter if I am lucky and it's close enough. I wish it was walking. If I could see it walking past the car, I'd know when to shoot it. It was close enough. Alright, ah, okay. So th there was a lot of changes between release and uh, uh, a year ago, but I think there's even more now. Uh, a year ago, did you have the chance for um, motorbikes? I don't think so. I think base building was in, wasn't it? Hang on, let's get back the bike. Yeah, everything up to the motorbikes. Yeah. Therese was in and Pontus and motorbikes and yeah. Um, yeah, they brought a few more things in since, but I'm not sure m anything as major as those. I'm waiting for another DLC like um, Alpine. Uh, oh, come on, what's. Alpine Retreat, was it? Can loot those later. Right, I've got safe house indicator coming up on my screen.
Well, when you're a beginner, you... Oh, <sighs> beginner's the wrong word. When you're starting out in the game with the kit that you have and the vulnerabilities that you have, you you really are foolish not to as a player. Right. What's going on here? So this is an army vehicle. As you can see. Ville 445. Um, yeah. The Volvo, I think, was four fo uh, was Volvo 440. Hey, there we go. Another auto rifle. I wonder what quality that was. I can check when we get inside. So, indications of safe houses here, 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 and here. Right, let's check what that rifle was. Is it a one uh, crown or a two crown? It was a two crown! Yay! That's useful. That actually becomes starting to be useful. Sorry for the noise off. That was an ambulance going by. So we've got ourselves another safe house in the area. How much kit have I got? That's just out of interest with you for your playthrough. Did you have a favourite set of weaponry that you used, or uh, um, or did you just go along with what you wanted? And where's the recycling? Ah, this is a nice touch I like about the place as well. So, organ. Right, yeah, yeah, the 50 cal sniper and the N9, the US. Do like this? How they do this? You don't have. You only have the three tunes, but um, it's a nice little touch. Ooh, there's a box up there. Hang on a sec. Identify the relay beacon. Right, recycling can go in the recycling, and I want to get rid of the molar. And we have a bike, don't we? We came out here not to find a safe house, though we did. We came out here to... Uh, get to a radio station so let's make our way to the radio we seem to be getting our share of um, rivals coming in here into the region so we have that's where we're trying to get to. Right, so there's one of the side missions would appear to be on the way. Whoa, Hunter!
and we have another another rival generated oh there's a you see there's a runner come in missed time to relocate And there's another one over there somewhere. Hang on. Stuff going on here that I haven't spotted earlier. So. Soldiers. Is this the patrol that they talked about on the um, being sent out from the right? Our last stand. I'm sure that there's uh, westerns, aren't there, that with people dying in shootouts in graveyards. Right, so that was a, a, an auto rifle that I picked up. But I think get one to cover. Picked up AG five, so that's the five five six um, rifle. But it's a much lower quality. Again, it's a one crown as opposed to the two crown. So I shall box that, and I don't want to be carrying the five five six ammunition at the moment. Rams than I normally would, to be honest. I'm very tempted to get rid of the submachine gun, but at the moment I'm finding it use too useful. Let's try and get out to that um Did we loot this guy or not? I can't remember. No, we didn't. One round of bird shot. Really? One round? Let's welcome to your lurk there, uh, bu uh, buckets. Been so there's a mission in there. With two weapons in the schematic to be found. Ooh, we've got a flyer over there, but we'll keep walk going by. Another relay bacon. Whoa! What have we got here? So 
remains of a flyer with a comma rate. Not where this looks like uh, civil defence as opposed to army. That wasn't for fatigues. Ah, this is your favourite uh, rifle, uh, so auto rifle then. And we have some civilians here gunned down. I wonder who gunned them down. Was that the hunter gunned them down? Probably was, wasn't it? Right, anything? Oh, I'm overweight. Uh, I'm overweight. Really is the issue of let's get the bike back on the bike because you can use a bike when you're overloaded when you're overloaded the only way to get around quickly is a bike or a motorbike the um, you s can't run you can't fast travel you can only get around on two wheels at any speed So when you bought the game, did you buy it with uh, a whole lot of um, DLCs or did you just buy the base game? See I'm trying to run and this is as fast as I can move. There's a lot there I was going to recycle. Uh, attachments, empty, put uh, infrared on the uh, binoculars. down a reasonable amount now. Leave that. So we have beacons around. They've got patrol the beach each of the relay beacons have got local patrols of uh, uh, robots and it would appear that it is mostly uh, runners but with uh, perhaps a hunter or maybe more but that's what it appears hope I can brazen it past that patrol I can good there's another light there moving so that's another uh, another uh, runner suspicious but not Hang on, there's stuff on the roof of that truck. A 
doesn't look as though the runner's coming up here. Right, so there's stuff on the, there's a man up there. Let's see if we can get up. We've got this stack. So 762, he's got something else beside him. A hunting rifle of sort. Yeah. What size hunting rifle was that? So it's a one crown again, not two, not size. So on we go. We've got the relay station up on the relay beacon. Red lights, that kind of indicates that what have we got? Yeah, I can hear a dog out. We've alerted them, unfortunately. We'll get under cover. A light brown t shirt. Anything else in here? Oh, yep. Oh, makeup. Light doesn't want to go out. That's great. And there is very much the sort of the the placement of the here in hidden history berlin wall has fallen rough translation keep picking up 32 yeah um it's worth breaking down your 32 uh break it down because you then can remold it into nine mil or whatever you need it for um and there is actually a, a relatively useful uh, experimental ammo for the 32 um, it's a, a medical one so you if you're in a party you have fantastic fun shooting uh, your, uh, uh, your, your your other members of your party with the 32 cal um, and so to heal them it's a fantastic idea but you can normally find a, th a, 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 a molar 32 somewhere around are you aware of what that uh, what, uh, that pistol is actually modelled on? That's two robots down. I was hoping. Right. Is that a, is that a tick? That was a tick. love how the target isn't quite stand still for a moment I want to be able to shoot at you Yeah. 
I love how they can manage to get into a closed room behind your back. I thought they'd fix that bug, but apparently not. It would appear that one is in the garage. But I can't get into the garage myself. So I think we can safely ignore that one. If that's really where he is. Yep, in the garage. I can't get in there. They have their own game engine, they don't use uh, anybody else's uh, and it's it's great in so many ways but there's some there's little funnies sometimes. So there's another one up ahead. problem with it so this is the side mission problem with uh, not being able to take it out is the fact that I am kind of stuck so there's a body in there Anything. There's a radio there. Am I can I get up onto the roof? He hit me once for 50. Buckshot, yeah. That buckshot hurt. So, one of the... One of the rifles has just evolved into a level 2 e rifle. Anything here that's worth having. Oh, there was a firefight in here. Ah, shotgun. Pretty crappy shotgun by the looks of it. Blood trails, handprint on the wall. And a body in the bath with blood going up to it. No. Not sure quite how that. Yeah, okay. Let's Firework underneath your pillow.
Oh, we forgot to go in. Yeah, we saw him, but we didn't go in, did we? Right. So we've got picked up a reasonable amount of loot here, including... We didn't pick up a firearm though, did we? We have, yes, we Ah, we have a better we we have a better nine mil pistol. That's definitely worth using instead of the one's crown. We'll take the silencer off that, unload it. So that can easily be there. We'll pop hang on, I'm just hearing a something just outside. And another one. Let's get some first aid done. Noises that the trapped um, runner is making is disconcerting. Right, pick up our bike again. Let's actually just put a full heel in. I have a little friend has come to see me. Lyra, come here. Come here. Come here. Do you want to be on stream? Come on. Come here. There we go. No. Come here, Lyra. No, she's not. Never mind. A four-legged friend had come to visit. I think my four-legged friend had got a new chew and wanted to show me the new chew. Du är nära nästa radioton som orsakar signalstörningen nu. Jag tror du ligger gömt ganska långt in i skogen här Gravtorp. Vi måste utgå från att vi har en väldigt kort tid på oss och skapa kontakt. Fienden kan uppenbarligen aktivera nya störare. Do you hear the dogs up there? Ooh, that was a hunter. Yeah, there's a hunter there. How many dogs do we seem to have? I'm guessing the lights are ticks. Yeah, there's one hunter there. Uh, sorry, one dog there, one dog there. Is it just the one hunter? There's at least three dogs. Four dogs, perhaps? One 
two yeah it's at least four dogs there's a tick I'm gonna regret this probably putting a, a suppressor on is going to reduce the amount of damage I can do so that's one tick out That's a tick coming at me. I'm not running particularly from the tick, but more from the fact that it's going to have friends until I can locate where the friends are. gas carrying friends right they seem to be calming down a bit Trees sometimes are an advantage and sometimes they're a hindrance because I'm trying to get a line of sight. They seem to know where I am. Shoot and scoot. Gotten that it had got a gas. They seem to have calmed down again. Gas mask makes it even harder to get line of sight. I wear gas mask. You can see how the vision is immediately impaired by wearing gas mask. Detected. Ruddy gas.
However, I hurt it. I hurt it quite bad. Where'd it go to? So there's a dog down to the right and the hunter's down there as well. Hunter didn't like that. Where's the hunter? I'm not letting you get away. Exit one hunter who f had fallen down a cliff in pursuing me. Right, get rid of the gas mask and out. This is why I say at times I wish I could climb properly rather than scrambling up like quite like that. Well, we have a tick on the radio equipment. So nothing in here was the just loot. Nothing. Right, let's get rid of this gas mask. So I can see. The weird thing is, I could put sunnies on, and in the night, it doesn't affect. I hear another hunter. It doesn't affect how well I see. Instantly put gas mask on, and instantly your There's a hunter on out there. Get myself some cover so I can run. I hope that he doesn't have gas. Right, so there's a radio. And again, you've got two worldviews competing there, telling the story. Vi måste undersöka de andra delarna av Östertörn. 
Varje område har en ledningsbunker, så, så vi borde kunna hitta nya spår att följa upp utifrån operationskartorna där. Ja, och kanske hitta fler överlevande också. Vi är inte ensamma. Det kan vi inte vara. Det gäller bara att hitta dem. Vi borde försöka kontakta de där sovjeterna igen. Jag måste få reda på vilka fienden är och var de befinner sig. Got that one. Oh, and there's something else out there as well. Another flipping hunter. How many of them are there? have a look in this military storage so oh HP5 you might recognize that rifle or not rifle, but you might recognize the uh, submachine gun. Hotla. And another. Uh, ooh, an AI-76, two crown, and another AG. So there's a fair few weapons in here, but we're now overweight again. Well, what a surprise, and with a... with a, a um, another hunter outside please don't have a gas hearing any more hunters right let's have a look at the map where are we yeah we've got this got these two locations here to go see we've got location here location here I think we make our way back to the church and unload and looking at the time ah right yes the mo uh, motorbikes are, are, are great yes they are sorry I hadn't spotted that um, yeah the you don't know right okay right the um, the Mola is actually modelled on the Walter PPK, uh, the pistol, the handgun that's um, uh, made famous by James Bond in the films. Uh, it was the apparently the standard um, uh, police firearm of the time. Uh, the Glock. Uh, 
that I'm nine mil pistol that I'm using and I've deliberately pronounced it that way this nine mil um, is modeled on the Glock nine mil pistol um, the AG4 is um, model it's a Swedish adaption of a Hockler uh, Hockler and Cock uh, 762 battle rifle from the 1950s uh, the uh, AG5 the assault rifle uh, this one is modeled on a Swedish adaption of the FN Cal that was became in the late 80s the main assault rifle of the Swedish Armed Forces um, and this one that we've picked up this rocket launcher was known to British Marines as the Carl Gustav um, and were used with great effect uh, bunker busting down in the Falklands um, the AI-76 well I don't think you need to guess too hard of what that is modelled on uh, that's modelled on the a uh, AK-74 no actually that's actually the AK-47 because it's a 762 I believe uh, let's just quickly check what ammunition not, I don't want to sign the slot look at what ammo it wants yeah it wants 762 so that's the, that's the AK-40 uh, a version of the AK-47 um, this is Hockler and Cock uh, MP6 is, uh, no MP5 um, sta staple of all sorts of uh, um, uh, shooting games it came uh, it came widely known at least in the UK uh, back in 82 when they were used by the SAS for the Iranian embassy siege um, yeah anybody's guess anybody's guess that's it's supposed to be based on s a, a variety of uh, um, European hunting rifles and the same goes for the Mauser no wonder we're over weight though we're carrying all these firearms so let's get ourselves back on the bike get ourselves back to the church and get ourselves wrapped up for the night because I think it is time for wrap up now there is no guarantee that we're not going to get intercepted on the way back uh, roaming pro uh, patrols that could be something or no that's a street light we're okay on that one I thought for a moment that was a, a light on a robot right careful of the debris on the road yeah they made us the flyer is are the most observant because they have to be that's their job looks like we broke contact okay I caught some of the debris unfortunately but it threw me but I managed to get through there right go oh 
there's a robot hopefully it will ignore us long enough it's far enough away and we're on a bike so it sh doesn't identify us as a threat or doesn't seem to I need to loot through here properly at some point as well but for the moment let's actually get stuff into storage and recycled and then 